Japan were training hard at their base in George in the Western Cape. The Blue Samurai qualified for the last 16 against all the odds, setting aside more fancied teams Denmark and Cameroon. Their reputation was at a low when the tournament started after losing four successive games in the warm-ups. At that time, coach Takeshi Okada was ridiculed for setting a semi-final spot as the team's target in South Africa. Defender Marcus Tulio, who is of Japanese-Brazilian origin, thinks that Japan's performance in the group stage has made the world take notice. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, 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 the world no, no, no have the, the good impression of Japan, but now we transform uh, this impression in good, in good impression and we play and do our best for the win the game. The Japanese know that Paraguay are their toughest challenge so far. Yeah, it's so difficult game. They play very well. They have the good strikers. But we, we have the confidence in our team and play to win. Japan have won only one of their six previous matches against Paraguay. Three games ended in a draw. Could they defy the odds yet again?